Hi guys, it's Kaylee and before I get into this video, I just wanted to let you know about a lot of the art and stuff I work on that I have for sale in case you're interested. I like to make these taxidermy bug shadow boxes. I mostly work with butterflies and moths, but I also do beetles and all kinds of other insects. And I have these for sale in my Etsy store and they're a great way to I don't know, kind of combine your love of art and science if you're into this sort of thing and how beautiful bugs can be. And I also have um, t-shirts and tons of other stuff. So I have three shops for that kind of stuff. So I have my Tee Public store, which is really cool because a lot of the times they will have sales where their shirts go on sale for only $14, which is crazy. And I also have a Society6 shop which I like because they have a little bit more variety than Tee Public, and they also have larger sizes in a lot of things. And I also have a Society6 shop, um, which I have mainly just because I like that they offer different things like mugs and pillows and even art prints. So if any of those things are interesting to you, I will have them linked down below. And I appreciate it so much if you would check it out or share it with anyone else who you think might be interested. Hi guys, it's Kaylee and today I wanted to do a little mini Killstar haul for you guys. Um, recently they had a big sale where they had 25% off of their already clearanced items. so. I couldn't resist. I had to take advantage of it because I've been wanting to get some Killstar stuff and try out their clothing for a long time. If you don't know about Killstar, they build themselves as the original occult luxury brand. I don't know how true that is, but they are definitely one of the um, first brands to really like, you know, sell kind of a culty, witchy, like, you know, semi satanic kind of stuff. And um, I don't I love that kind of style, obviously. <laughs> it's not for everyone. It can be quite abrasive, but I personally love it. And um, so I've been kind of wanting to try them out for a while, but their prices are kind of expensive. Um, they're not ridiculous, but they are a little bit on the pricey side for how I usually shop. And they're also, they don't really have plus sizes. They do go up to size, um, at least for their women's sizes, they go up to like a size XXL, I believe, which you can check the measurements on their website, but I believe that is usually billed as like, I don't know, I'm terrible at correlating that with, <laughs> with like sizes, but um, it has like the inches, you know, and their size chart is really bad. It doesn't have like a women's clothing size chart for like pants, for example. Um, which that was one of the things I mainly wanted to get from them was like some of their really cool bell-bottom pants um, But I have no idea if my big fat ass is gonna fit in them or not So <laughs> I got um, three items that were on sale So they were like I don't know probably half off of their original price and then I got one item that was not on sale but um, it wasn't too expensive. So I thought I would just share this with you guys if I have any other like beautiful, fat, spoopy babes out there who are on the bigger end of the spectrum and we're plus size and you're into a culty kind of fashion and kill star and stuff and you're not really sure if their clothes are gonna fit you. I figured I would kind of um, crash test them for you guys and share my experience. Um, just in case it helps somebody else out. So the first thing I got that I was really excited about is these velvet bell-bottom pants and they have this really cool kind of psychedelic um, pentagram design all over them. They're fabulous. I, this was the thing I was most nervous about not fitting and um but i had hope because it is quite stretchy it's a very stretchy material and sure enough when i did first put it on um i was really disappointed because i could like a lot of things because i have such a big butt and big thighs i could kind of get it you know up past my knees up past my lower thighs but then i couldn't really get it any higher but i decided to give it one last try before i gave up on it and i just sort of like 
you know, gently tugged the material up over my thighs where they were kind of sticking and just kind of wiggled my way into it. And sure enough, the fabric is really forgiving. It did stretch. It did go on. Um, it kind of sits lower than I would like it to on my hips just because, like I said, I, I fill it out so much that it can't really go as high as it's meant to go. But um, it's not uncomfortable. It is like a nice stretchy material. It's very soft. I love that it's velvet. And I don't know, I just feel so cool in these pants. I love them. They are a snug fit. And for reference, I am a size 22 in bottoms usually, and I'm around like a size 20 in tops. And it has like the Killstar branding and everything in there. It's just very cool. I love these pants. Even if they don't fit 100% perfectly, I am just like too in love with them. I'm going to have to keep them. I just don't think I will be able to wear like a cute crop top with these or something like I was planning. I will just have to make sure I wear, you know, like a longer flowy top that kind of covers the top of it so you can't see, you know, the top of my butt crack hanging out or whatever. Um, <laughs> not so cute, but I, I don't know. I just love these too much. I can't give up on them. And I was like really happy. I managed to squeeze my way into them. Next is another item I was really excited about. And it is this really cool, um, skirt. And this is like a really long, I have all these really long things that don't really fit on camera that well. So I, it is like this really long, um, maxi skirt and it has this beautiful funky occult print all over it like it has this like really occulty pentagram thing and like a pentagram on a skull and this seal and like a sun and just so much cool stuff and alchemy symbols and how can you not love it I love it and I could just imagine you know having this be like such a bold statement piece and then mixing it with really simple black accessories like just a simple strappy black tank top and like a you know a black hat and some sandals or something It'd be such a cute summer look spoopy summer look <laughs> but yeah this actually it is also a very stretchy very forgiving material it is um it feels like polyester or something if i'm not mistaken and um, yeah, and it's just really comfy. I had no problem whatsoever squeezing into this. I was a little bit um, worried that it might be too tight because on the site it does describe it as kind of bodycon. But um, I didn't really find that at all. It's maybe like a little bit tighter around the hips and waist area, but it flares out pretty well, but it's not too tight and confining. It's not super flowy or billowy or anything like a lot of maxi skirts, but it is super, um, it's just really comfy. I love this. I can really see myself like living in this this summer. And the next thing I got, again with the long things that are <laughs> hard to fit on camera, but um, this was the one thing I got that wasn't on sale, but it was still a um, pretty decent price, I think. It is this Bast um, maxi dress, and it has this really cool print of like this Egyptian goddess cat and if you didn't know Bast was like this um, Egyptian goddess and her animal she's often portrayed with cats and that was like her patron animal um, and I'm like really into you know Egyptian stuff ancient Egyptian folklore and mythology and stuff like that and iconography so um, yeah I was really tempted I had to get this dress and again, it's um, it's a little bit tighter than I would probably prefer around like my tummy and stuff, but it fits just fine. It is a nice, very comfy, stretchy material, kind of like jersey material. It's a nice long maxi dress. I I hate it when maxi dresses are like either too long or they're like a little bit shorter. I feel like this one's about the perfect length. So yeah, really happy with that one. Not don't really have any complaints. And the last item I got was this really cool um, alchemy scarf. It has all these really cool alchemy symbols on it and it's also cool because it's reversible. Um, one side's like black with white symbols and the other side is white with black symbols and um, 
<laughs> I know it's like spring and spring's right around the corner, but um, yeah, if you know anything about Michigan, the weather changes pretty rapidly, so I'm um, pretty certain we're gonna have like some cold, nippy, chilly, especially really windy days coming up until we get into summertime basically. So um, yeah, I don't regret this purchase at all. And I needed a cute new scarf anyway, and this one is like perfect because I like how even if you're wearing like a really plain, boring jacket or coat or something, this can really spice it up. So yeah, that's my little Killstar haul. Like I said, it's kind of a mini haul. I didn't get a whole lot of stuff because it is pretty expensive. But um, overall, I'm really pleased. Um, the XXL size stuff doesn't fit quite as well as I wanted it to. It's a little bit too tight. Um, I would love to try out some of their kind of oversized um, t-shirts and sweaters like that are kind of unisex so they're designed for men to wear them too so they tend to be a lot bigger and baggier for whatever just the way things worked out I happened to get a lot of stuff that was like a lot more form-fitting and you know more bodycon so it's not gonna be a looser style but um, yeah, I would love to try some looser stuff. If any of you guys out there are plus size or have any experience with the bigger um, Killstar sizes, you can let me know in the comments below what your experience is. And if you like this video and you'd like to see more like it, just you know, give me a like and let me know. Comment below if you want. And um, if you want to, feel free to subscribe. I'd love to have you here on my channel with me and my coven of beautiful spoofies. And as always, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really appreciate you and love you so much. And never forget that you are beautiful just the way you are and to always be yourself. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.